You have to embrace getting older, life is precious, and when you've lost a lot of people, you realize that each day is a gift. The formula of happiness and success is just being actually yourself, in the most vivid possible way you can. Put blinders onto those things that conspire to hold you back, especially the ones in your own head. I think the best role models for women are people who are fruitfully and confidently themselves, who bring light into the world. Sometimes you love, and you learn, and you move on, and that's okay. It's amazing what you can get, if you quietly, clearly, and authoritatively demand it. True freedom is understanding, that we have a choice, in who and what we allow to have power over us. The great gift of human beings, is that we have the power of empathy, we can all sense a mysterious connection to each other. Good looks fade, but a good heart, keeps you beautiful forever. What makes you different or weird, that's your strength. I think that you find your own way. You have your own rules. You have your own understanding of yourself, and that's what you're going to count on. In the end, it's what feels right to you, not what your mother told you, not what some actress told you, not what anybody else told you, but the still, small voice. The minute you start caring about what other people think, is the minute you stop being yourself. We need art as much as we need good works, you need it like food, you need it for inspiration, to keep going on the days that you're low, we need each other in that way. You don't have to choose, you can do both, you should do what you love. Integrate what you believe in every single area of your life. Take your heart to work and ask the most and best of everybody else too. We are who we're going to be, when we're very old, and when we're very old, we are who we were, when we were eight. Motherhood has a humanizing effect. It reduces everything to essentials. My advice, don't waste so much time worrying about your skin or your weight. Develop what you do, what you put your hands on in the world. Disrespect invites disrespect. Violence incites violence. When the powerful use their position to bully others, we all lose. I'm curious about people. That's the essence of my acting. I'm interested in what it would be like to be you. One of the most important keys to acting is curiosity. I am curious to the point of being nosy. What that means is you want to devour lives. You're eager to put on their shoes and wear their clothes and have them become a part of you. All people contain mystery, and when you act, you want to plumb that mystery until everything is known to you. You don't have to be famous, you just have to make your mother and father proud of you. Don't give up or give in in the face of patronizing ridicule, amused disdain, or being ignored. You just have to keep on doing what you do. It's the lesson I get from my husband, he just says, keep going, start by starting.
There will always be people telling you, you can't. Look them in the eyes and say, watch me.